So Martin, the CTX range has been around for a while, but you've made some refinements, haven't you? You've made some improvements. We have. Uh, the European side of the business has always been the CTX range. Uh, we've added that uh, technology from uh, the European design machines and then added it to the basis of the NLX, which has formed the backbone of the Morisiki turning range for a great number of years. And what are the changes? What, what's new? Well, what's new is there's a new spindle. Uh, we've seen on the milling machines the uh, a speed master. On the turning machines, we have the turn master for the main spindles and uh, counter spindles, uh, which have more power, greater uh, life, more stability, um, and uh, beautifully the, uh, adding the 36 months uh, warranty to that. Yeah, that, that's unheard of pretty much, isn't it? That, that's quite a big, it's nice to know you're making a big investment for a machine. You can, it's almost, you can forget about a spindle for three years. Uh, that's the idea behind it, yes. Um, we're looking to make everything that little bit more refined, uh, adding the stabilities that we're taking from both the European and the Japanese design machines, uh, combining them. Uh, and getting the best at the end, the best product that's possible. And I note, obviously, there's upgrades in the CNC control as well. That's very true. On the machine uh, control behind you, we've, although we've looked at the uh, CLOS with the uh, NLX, the MAPS control, uh, on this one it has the Siemens control, very familiar uh, to many uh, users, uh, so the customers can have exactly what they want, so whether it's MAPS, with the, the, the build quality, or the Siemens with the build quality. We have flexibility now. Obviously the CLOS has got lots of, you know, it's app based, it's a very easy to use, intuitive design. And it's got this on the side of the machine here, it's got, you've got you know, the technology cycles, machine cycle, gear skiving, you know, multi-feed, threading. All of, all of these cycles are simply apps on the machine. The machine will come with the apps that are uh, practical, uh, to that machine, so if you've added extra functionality to the machine, the apps will cover that functionality. Um, in this instance here, we're doing a lot of uh, uh, eccentric turning, uh, things of that sort of nature. It's simply a matter of using, utilizing the programming matrix, fill in the gaps, and uh, start manufacturing. Okay, so when I used to do eccentric turning, it was a nightmare. You're telling me nowadays, if I was doing it, it's just, uh, it's just questions and answers, conversational. Questions and answers, yes. Uh, the fact with these new spindles as well, they can run at much higher speeds than uh, traditionally, um, so you can actually have a, a more productive uh, nature as well. So it's, it's, mil it's turned on rather than milled on? That's exactly true. Uh, there's a component knocking around here that has uh, a triangular form with radiuses, uh, offset uh, crank type uh, uh, radius uh, feature, and uh, also the, an elliptical turned feature. Uh, we're very uh, simple and straightforward uh, to program. Fascinating. I, I just wish you had it in 1996 when I needed it. Yes, it, it, we're always moving forward. <laughs> just waiting to see us in two more years' time and where we'll be from there. Is, so, is this machine going to be a big seller? Yes, it will be a big seller. It's uh, complementary to the uh, NLX uh, range. It has the Siemens, as we've mentioned. It has the new control, uh, new spindle controls and everything that work with it to give us the life and stability. Uh, you can even have the same turret as the NLX on this machine and vice versa it can be to fit the customer shop. So there is a big overlap, you've got the advantage, of, well not an advantage, you've just got the choice of the additional control as well. That's true and at the end of the day the customer needs the choice so he can make the best uh, production demands upon him.